Hi, I'm Mike from No Conference. No Conference Education. We are here to help as many people as possible enjoy their life, enjoy their investments, enjoy their life investing. And I love sharing these concepts with you. I am dedicated to making these videos for you for free. Please comment below. Please subscribe as well and get the notifications turned on so that you know that when I put a video up, you'll actually see it in your inbox and in your email. So today's video is on gratitude. Gratitude is the most important word in the English language. It can change everything in your life, everything. It's unbelievable. So, so let me start with this. Before I got married, my wife taught me about this uh, gratitude thing, but prior to, to me learning about gratitude, I took, I, life came at me in certain ways that I thought were just out of control. Uh, I, I only took a job when it showed up in front of me and I would take whatever came my way. If my car broke, I scramble around trying to fix it. I had no control of my life. Uh, I then met my wife and um, she taught me about being grateful and the gratitude exercise I'm going to tell you right now. I, I, I was kind of an anxious person. I don't want to say angry, but I, I thought that the world owed me more <laughs> than I was getting. And so when she taught me gratitude and just to be grateful for what you have, I'm not saying just be passively grateful and just accept whatever it is that comes your way. I'm saying being grateful in such a loving way that you actually attract the good into your life. That's huge. I mean, that is huge. And she taught me that right from the get go 35 years ago. And I've exercised it every day. And so how do you actually bring this into your life? Well, you can't be angry and grateful at the same time. You just can't do it. You can't be grateful and have road rage going on at the same time. I see people <laughs> driving like maniacs and they get all frustrated and Somebody's in the left lane and they're going too slow and they're shaking their fists. And the only thing that's going on right now with that person is, is road rage. And there is no gratitude flowing. But when you're just cruising in the right lane and everything's fine and you're just thinking about what a great day that you are having, what a great day that you're going to have, you experience this joy that actually attracts more good to you. Uh, I've, I've had people say, oh yeah, well, it's easy for you to be grateful. You have a, a great family and you have a great life and you, you're, you've got enough money. And well, I hate to tell you, but it's gratitude first, then the good things. It's not the good things and that I'm grateful for the good things. I promise you that. So think about it. Who cares what came first? Be grateful now. Be grateful now. Just be grateful for the oxygen that is entering and exiting your lungs. Be grateful for the sun that shines down upon you and feels so wonderful when you're, when you're outside. There are an unlimited things that, that you are, are actually able to be grateful for. I promise you it will change your life the moment you become grateful. Now, yes, I slip out back into my old ways with my negative thoughts on, boy, you know, that was just a real string of bad luck that happened. This happened uh, to, in me, uh, to me in my life. I, I have those uh, relapses, right? And as you get better and better at this, the time that you relapse becomes shorter periods of time. 
uh, when I when I do relapse now, I'll have a thought come into my head, which will be, boy, I, I can't believe that this happened to me. Well, as soon as that happens, I tell myself I no longer have that that thought no longer serves me. Something like that, where I just shut it down before it even starts. That that attitude no longer serves me. And I don't question it. I don't have a discussion about what did serve me and what didn't serve me. I just, that thought, that belief, that emotion no longer serves me. And boom, I'm back in gratitude. And I promise you, I live every moment of every day in gratitude. Sounds like corny, but I promise you, it works. I don't care how bad things are going. Get in the gratitude mode and things will turn around. How many times have you made a decision? Boy, today is going to be tough. I have to do this. I have to do that. I've got all these things on my schedule. And you get done at the end of the day and they're like, wow, I was right. It was a tough day. And it's because of the decision that you made it to be tough prior to it ever happening. But if you walk through the day being grateful that you have the ability to take care of these tasks and to do them pretty darn well, you are going to be a changed person. Your life is going to be amazing. And gratitude comes first. The amazingness comes next. Okay? So thought for the day is gratitude. Thanks for listening. Please subscribe below. Click the notification bell if you haven't done so already. You'll know I plan on doing a lot of videos and I want to see everybody benefit from these things and, and drop a comment below. Let me hear from you. Let, let me know what other subjects you would like to hear about, if anything, or just let me know that, hey, I like your stuff or, or not. <laughs> All right. Thanks again. Mike from No Conference Education. Thank you.